everyone and welcome back to another episode of Berkeley TV. I'm Filippo. And I'm Liam. What are we going to see today then? Today we're going to be looking at pumpkin painting, some bloopers, kindergarten sports day highlights, an interview with the Spirit Shirt Contest winners, and an announcement for Loy Cretong. This thing sounds very cool. Let's take a look. Firstly, we'll see some students painting pumpkins. Welcome everyone to the Berkeley TV pumpkin painting segment. On my right, we have... Kento. And on my left, we have... Darwin. Now, the rules are simple for this section. Kento is part of Team 1, and Darwin is part of Team 2. These two pumpkins, they're going to be painting them. However, there's a catch. Every 30 seconds, I'm going to shout out, switch now, and then two other unseen teammates are going to replace them and, you know, paint their part. And then another 30 seconds, then another 30 seconds, it alternates. We have here the paint that shall be used to color. All right. Are you two ready? Yeah. yeah. Three, two, one. Start painting your pumpkin. You have 30 seconds. Okay, stop painting. It is time to switch. Sure. So, will the other team please come in? Teammates. Switch! Time to switch. You just check off this guy. Very okay, time to stop and switch. Switch! Thirty seconds! Okay, stop and switch. Okay, time to switch. Put down your paintbrush again. fully decorated. Let's have a look at them. Now, team one, will you pick up your <laughs> pumpkin? Let's have a look at that. Alright, <laughs> so we have, um, would you like to tell me if you had a design in mind? Like, who is this? Uh, it's, uh, Nakata Hide Doshi. Who? It's, uh, Japanese person that who lives in next to my house. Well, I'm sure he'd be very honored to be in today's Berkeley TV as a special cameo. And now, put it down please. And now we have Darwin Team 2. Would you pick up the pumpkin? Let's see what your design is. Alright, so it's something similar but a bit more messy. Do you have a did you have a certain concept in mind? No. No? Did you have a guess as to who that might be? No. No? No clue. Oh. I'm gonna be honest. This guy is not looking very happy at me, very frowning. How about this guy? Yeah, he's looking pretty good. He's looking pretty good. George. So, then it was a of an artistic mess around here. So, then it was pretty simplistic. I'm gonna have to say, there's only one way to look at You, <laughs> team two has won. They have the better design than team number one. It is decided too bad. Thank you everybody for watching this segment of Berkeley TV Pumpkin Painting. Goodbye. That was very cool. Next we have some Berkeley TV bloopers to laugh at. Introduct. <laughs> That's it, it's all.
all I have. Talk to the <laughs> No. Why can't we do sports when I can go do sports on the weekend at the sports club? Yeah, you can go ahead and record me. I expect guys. Berkeley TV. Wait, no, no, no. My mask fell off. Hold on. We'll be having a look at ping pong. Ping pong. Well, that's good enough, right? Okay. <laughs> Perfect. Yay! We can do it all. Is my head in view? That's all the activities we have. Wait, I need to think what to say. What if I say, I'm not ready yet, obviously. I, that's all we have for today, folks. We're the Berkeley Lions, hear us. Now on the Kindergarten Sports Day highlights. I now declare the Berkeley 2020 House Olympic Games open. That was nice. Now we have some interviews with our two spirit shirt contest winners. Can you give an introduction about yourself? Oh yeah, uh, hi, my name's Celine. Uh, I'm in grade 10 right now. So how did you feel when you found out that you won the design? Uh, I was really surprised and excited about it because it's like my first time winning something big or putting, yeah. And can you tell us how you make your design? Yeah, uh, I drew, I look at, at some uh, lion's picture and I drew it on my notebook and, and then I take a picture of the design and put it with the shop and I just try to make it look as similar as possible to the original design of it in my notebook. Okay, thank you. We hope to see you back in school soon. Yeah, thank you. Hi. Since I wanted to make the design really simple, so people from different grades can all wear, um, I drew the lion with lines. I am happy that people are going to wear the shirt that I designed and I hope everyone likes it. Thank you, Celine and Miu. Coming up is an announcement from Loy Croton. Hey, Anna. Did you know Loy Croton is coming on this Saturday? Really? Wow! And our school will be celebrating at our events in the basketball court. I would like to join. What are we going to do? We have several tie boots there, such as making coasters, creating bookmarks, playing tie play, and we have free ice cream. Ooh, I can't wait to join. See you all there! Thank you. And finally, it's time for some information about Hidden Pumpkin Scavenger Hunt. Congratulations to Athena in Grade 4 on finding the Hidden Pumpkin in the garden. We've now come to the last week for the Hidden Pumpkin Scavenger Hunt. The last three challenges were very easy to find, so this time it'll be in a much harder place. Also, there will be no hint, but you will win an extra prize for finding it. Have fun finding it! That's all we have for today. Thanks for watching. We are the Berkeley Lions. Hear us roar!